Have you been promised the world by local phlebotomy classes? They'll say you can get a job as a phlebotomist in just three to four weeks. And when you compare these classes with full-time programs, which are longer and more expensive, these classes sound amazing and make perfect sense. But beware, they might promise you that you can get a job as a phlebotomist and start a great career in healthcare drawing blood, but not everything about these classes is hunky-dory. Today, I will talk about the six things these local phlebotomy classes will never tell you. Before you enroll in weekend phlebotomy classes or a four-week local phlebotomy program, you need to know about these facts. So, let's go. By the way, I am Landon, and if you are new to the channel, here we share tips and tricks for busy adults to start their dream careers faster without student debt or spending years in the classroom. All right, so number one, these classes can be unaccredited. Unaccredited training programs can raise red flags in the eyes of an employer. And the majority of these local classes are from unaccredited sources. And that is a big problem. Just imagine, you're walking into a job interview and you're feeling confident. They have a look at your resume and they ask, where did you get your phlebotomy training? Is this an accredited university? I have never heard anything about this training company. Candidates just freeze up when they hear questions like this. And trust me, I would too. The problem is that these local classes are likely not prestigious, they aren't well known, and in healthcare, big name universities are typically loved and adored. And when you walk up to an interview with training from some random local institution, you could get lost in the crowd. And trust me, you don't want that. By the way, if you want your phlebotomy training to be affordable and you want to start your career faster, then you can check out the video Grant made. In his video, Grant talks about how you can get trained as a phlebotomist in just two months and get a university certificate for your phlebotomy training. It's one of our most popular videos and answers a burning question that we get all the time. I'll post the link below in the description and in the comments. Moving on, point number two, hidden cost. The biggest charm with these classes is that they seem cheap but they are not as cheap as you think. Some classes have additional costs for training material like books or kits, and that can definitely add up. And that's not all. You have to take time out of your day to drive to campus and attend these classes. Not only is that challenging, it also means you need to spend extra money on gas, parking permits, and other expenses. Ultimately, these things add up and the true cost could be much higher than you think. Point number three, local classes don't prepare you to get certified. More and more classes are preferring to hire certified phlebotomists. To get certified, you have to clear an exam conducted by institutions like NHA. Their certification is valid across the USA. Unfortunately, many of these local classes do not prepare you for your certification exam. Their training programs have a basic and limited curriculum. Even though they are faster and teach you how to draw blood, they provide little to no information on topics like anatomy, safety procedures, and HIPAA regulations. And to clear your exam and get certified, you need to know about all of this. And this is what we usually see. Students enroll in a local training program or classes close to where they live. Now, after some time, they decide to get certified. At that point, students realize how little they know and they might have to spend time and money just to prepare for the exam. It's just inefficient. Ideally, what you want is to enroll in the training program that not only prepares you for your career, but also for the certification exam. Point number four, you might have to settle for a lower salary. After attending these local classes, you might get a job as an entry-level phlebotomist at a local diagnostics chain. The salary you could get might fall short of the big figures quoted by local classes. From what we have seen, based on the data on different job portals, a certified phlebotomist is able to earn four to 6,000 more annually compared to an uncertified phlebotomist. Employers want someone they can trust with patients, and if you're certified, that's like a mark of authority. Being certified usually comes with better compensation and respect. And as I just said, local classes fail to get you there. And plus, you would want to move ahead in your career. Maybe you'd want to work in a hospital or a big diagnostics chain. Not being certified and doing phlebotomy training from a local organization could come back to haunt you. You don't want that. Point number five, no hands-on experience. Another problem, especially with online phlebotomy classes, there's no way for you to get your clinicals. You need hands-on clinical experience in drawing blood. 
What a few local training companies have started to do is they'll send you practice kits and you have to record yourself drawing blood or practicing on dummies. Think about it. How can you ever feel confident performing a venipuncture with a needle or drawing blood if you've only practiced with dummies? What you need is real life experience. The best way to get that if you are starting your career is through an externship where you get to work in a healthcare facility for a few weeks and practice working as a phlebotomist. Local classes unfortunately don't help you gain real life clinical work experience. And finally, point number six. With local classes, you're just another bloke with a phlebotomy training certificate. In other words, you don't stand apart. Consider this, if there are two candidates, one has completed phlebotomy training from a local institution, while the other has everything, the university certificate in phlebotomy training, certified as a phlebotomist by the NHA hands-on clinical experience, who stands out? You know the answer. Local phlebotomy classes are cheaper and they may appear to make a lot of sense, but you need to be aware of these five drawbacks before you enroll. And by the way, don't you want a better option where you can get a university certificate? Be ready to crush the certification exam, have some clinical experience under your belt, finish your training in just two months and something that is also affordable? Well, a training program like this exists. Grant reveals a training program that's not just convenient and affordable, but eliminates the problems I talked about above. Click on the link below. And let me know what you think. Well, that is it, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Subscribe to the channel. It really helps us produce more valuable content for you to reach your goals. This is Landon, signing off. Take care.